Probably gathered I'm at some little motor show or motor fest as we usually call them over here in Obi. Today it's uh, it being Father's Day what's happening is that they're doing something different this is called motor sorry not motor fest I keep saying motor fest this is called Father Fest. Well, here's one actually running on. Let's film this. Leave it already. Did you believe it? Yeah, today's little event here is called uh, Father Fest. So it's uh, something different to the norm. The annual uh, motor fest will be in August as usual. Oh, look at this, it's nice. And, um, but today is something for the fathers. <laughs> I don't know if they're doing some kind of celebrations for Father's Day and the families and all that later on. But for now, this afternoon, they have all these little motor cars turning up and advertised as Father Fest. Ooh, stunning paintwork on this. Now, uh, <clears throat> I arrived about two o'clock and there's no vehicles here at all. Almost thought they've got the wrong day. Now, just pause at some of these little motors. But no, I think it's supposed to run from three o'clock to about five ish or a bit later. Seen a lovely triumph over there. We'll have a look at that. <coughs> I see woodwork and uh, grabs my attention. Um, what's I looking at? Oh yeah, there's triumph over here. Yeah. So yesterday's Father Fest and a little motor, a little motor fest. Thing going on as well. Come back for this one. This is a lovely one. This I like this one. I am just just backtracking because I missed a few while I was talking. Mustang. It says here. Okay. Oh, look at this engine. Interesting. Eight cylinders. Oh, what have we got here? In, in, uh, I like these red burgundy interiors. God, oh, look. 
engine on that spine if you paid with that Mustang. Two, three, four cylinder. Small battery there, look. Excuse me. Do you know where the parade is? I'm looking for the dog parade or the parade. How are we doing? He's asking somebody where the parade is. He's on it, mate. You're on it. You know. This is the parade. I've decided not to go around naming all the vehicles. I'm going to leave it for you, the viewers, to decide what they are. Because I really don't know half the time. And the thing is, while I've been waiting all this time for this event to start, I've actually sunk a couple of ciders in the pub. So I hope I'm not slurring my words too much. Still arriving. <coughs> anyway, I was about to film this thing. Don't know what it is, but I like the colour. Okay, so this is a Lamborghini. Interesting detail. Yeah. Try and have a look at the front of it. There's so many people here, you see. Quite difficult to film. Oh, it would land again here. So there we go. Right then, moving on. <laughs> Ice cream wagon. <laughs> One Jeep. Yeah. It's quite angular, isn't it? It's sort of square edged, sharp edges. Mayflower. See if we can have a look inside here. Quite a nice dash. Who's shouting now? There's always somebody shouting. <laughs> Just going to stop filming for a minute while these idiots walk by, swearing away. That's quite nice. Okay. <laughs> TR6. I've seen this one before. <laughs> I remember this uh, umbrella roof canopy thing. Look at this engine though. It's quite impressive. Wow. 
made it nice and nice and nice and nice and nice and nice and nice Trying to make sure I don't get run over when I'm walking backwards. <coughs> Lotus here. You're not having a slushy one here. You're not having any more sugar. You just made the throw and there's actually a whole ice cream in the room. Slightly more modern vehicles. No idea what this is. What does this say here? Oh, it's an Alfa Romero. I should have known that. I do see a Rolls Royce over there, I'll have a look at that in a minute. We just come back from retro. Yeah, yeah. Nice. One that one was so beautiful. That is really nice. I saw this theatre arriving and I was, I was, because I heard it first, and it was so loud. I thought it was a motorbike coming along, and then I saw this. <laughs> Couldn't believe how loud it was. So the boot and the other uh, parts of it. I've seen the video, I was trying to call it. I was trying to call it. And it came off. And I'm like, oh, that's great. Mmm. 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 What a narrow bonnet. I wonder if that makes it difficult to service it. There's sound here. Oh, sorry. Let's see if you can read that. It just says Austin of England.
1957. I think it's uh, a ghost, Rolls Royce ghost, I'll have to check again. I always forget what the new ones are called. I know I checked, I checked it last year and I think it was a ghost, but we'll have to recheck. <clears throat> but if you know me, you know I like my old silver shadows on my S series Bentleys. So, I'm these newish things don't really do much for me. arriving and it's rather a large chap that was driving it and uh, he made the car look really small. <laughs> it is quite small isn't it? Keep the photo a secret for a while. Hmm. Anyway the previous one, the spider, I might as well say what it is, Ford Cortina 2000E. Doesn't mean a thing to me though, but uh, as I say, I don't know all the names of all the cars. I don't know why I'm filming this, it's a bit too new for my liking. Let's have a look, where am I now? I'm getting very close to the pub again. So go on, let's film some bikes. Super nice. Oh, I don't know. I'm at the wrong angle for this. <coughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> We're all starting them up now. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Nineteen sixty three Honda fifty. My dad had something similar to that. Yeah. Sheriff is coming. Again. This is not a Ford Cortina. No? <clears throat> this is a Ford Escort. <laughs> He's getting them mixed up. Ford Escort. <clears throat> I see this one quite a lot as well. Austin Cooper. This turns up at some of these shows as well. That. Not really into whatever this is, I'm going to say that's not really into that. Um, sunbeam, yep, yeah, that's alright. So we've got the, uh, the engine. The lighting is light a bit weird today. <coughs> All of that lot in such a tiny space, it's amazing. Well, it's 
try again. That siren's got me. <laughs> Getting a bit of trigger happy with that siren. But anyway, you're all right, mate. Oh, even in there, mate. Sorry, mate. Here you go, mate. So here, go. And over the headlamps too. This is gorgeous. Yeah, my favourite car of the day. This is absolutely lovely. Absolutely superb. Well, I've nearly reached the uh, the far end of the parade. I started off at the other end at Chestnut Avenue and I've worked my way down. And I think I've covered most of the things. Hmm. Certainly some very interesting vehicles as always. I like this Triumph. TR4. Very nice cars. No, getting close to wrapping this up. Mm. Nice dashboard on this one. <laughs> yeah, just refilming something, some noisy people got into my shot. Yeah, so TR6, go away people, go away, TR6, as I was saying, I only know it because it says it's on the back, Triumph TR6, and this is a new type Jaguar. You can't mistake this for anything else. It's really nice. Who else we got? Oh, it's all regular stuff here. Let's skip through this. Mustang, if you're interested in Mustangs. Not, no, not really my kind of thing. Let's not. No idea from this angle. Oh, Dame Lock. No. I've never seen a Dame Lock like that before. It has the crinkly uh, front of the grill though. Which is a Dame in the future. I don't think I've seen this one before. I'd have to look at the earlier videos. However, what have we got here? 
what do we have here? You've seen this, you've seen this lady walking about. There's no more room in London, Pontiac, I think it says. Pontiac. Why is this engine? Go on. It's very Australian. Okay, is it? Ooh. Let's give this a bit more airplay. Oh my god, that's surprising. Very plain Dutch. Oh. I think I'll finish this video on this lovely Austin 12 centenary, it says here. This may be the oldest car I've seen so far today. I've seen this before. Glorious, glorious. Gorgeous call. I think I might close the video on this. Well, interesting turnout. It's a bit better than I thought. Just when I arrived, I thought I'd got the wrong day because there was nothing here. Oh my god, more sirens. Just get past the Mercedes, they don't do anything for me. Lovely Austin there. Absolutely beautiful. I think that's about it. Time to put my feet up in the pub. Cheerio for now, see you next time.